and welcome to the new episode of the Charlie News. I am Eva Susan Robin and I will take you all through the major events unfolded at St. Charles in the past weeks. Environment Day celebrations and the inauguration of Akhila Kerala Balajana Sakyam were held on 5th June. The event was inaugurated by Mr. Radhakrishnan Saubarnika. Mr. Jalil Thanas, the patron of Kalamachari Sakyam, was present on the occasion. New leaders for the academic year 2023 were sworn in at a majestic English teacher ceremony that was held in the school on 14th of June 2023. Anders Joffin Ritchie and M.A. Rajalakshmi were declared as the school leaders for the academic year. A week-long reading activities and competitions were conducted in the school from 19th to 24th of the June 2023. Yoga Day was observed with great vigor and enthusiasm on 21st June. Physical Education Instructor Mr. Jijo Joy led the activities on the day. A seminar was conducted as part of anti drug Day in the school on 27th June. Member of Juvenile Justice Board Mrs. Jinsi Georgie was the resource person on the occasion. Selby Condes 2023 was held in the school on 22nd July. Students in various categories were found putting up very enthusiastic presentation on the day. Anubuma has more details on this. Eva, Spelby competitions were held on 9th of August. The competitions were meant for Standard 1 to 7th. An exciting contest for all the participants putting their best efforts in. The competitions were conducted in three categories. In Category 1, first prize was backed by Krishna Renish and the second prize was backed by shared by Joanna and Kairav. In Category 2, first prize was shared by uh, Abel Trijo and Jaden. In Category 2, second prize was backed by R. Sindhida. In Category 3, first prize was backed by Karthik Sujit and the second prize was backed by Emmanuel Jason. The competitions were the best example how accurate the Charlians are at the spelling. Back to you, Eva. Debate competition and title and the 2023 turned out to be a stunning exhibition of sheer and linguistic and debating skills of Charlians. In the closely contested finals, Team Progress emerged to be the winners. Earlier, our reporter, Varsha Karan, had caught up with the winners. Eva, we are joined by the winners of debate competition NT Mime 2023. With me are Sneha, Angel and Nayana. They will talk about their famous uh, victory in the debate competition 2023. So, how do you feel you won the debate competition, uh, which was unpredictable? Uh, we are extremely happy and uh, it, at this point of time I would like to express my sincere gratitude towards uh, teachers and all our friends who have supported us and encouraged uh, us a lot. What was his strategy and how did you prepare for it? Uh, I don't think that without strategy, a strategy, a competition could be won. And our strategy was collecting data, documents and materials from online and we are prepared for this very debate as well from online. And I'm really happy for our great victory. What do you think are the teachers' contribution to your success? Uh, we would say that it was our teachers' uh, contribution which played the key role in our success. And I don't think that we would have won the competition without our teachers' contribution. Um, so we would like in this moment, I would like to thank all each and every teachers who helped us with all their heart. Sneha, we know that you won the Best Speaker Award. How do you look at this achievement? So, I was quite happy when I came to know that I had won the Best Speaker Award. And also quite grateful that my uh, uh, to my te teammates who helped me. Because I think all the uh, participants who performed the other day were incredibly amazing with their speeches. And as I had already mentioned before, uh, teacher's contribution was the major reason why I got the chance to express my um, express my thoughts uh, uh, in, my, in my speech um, uh, so that it reaches the audience um, so, that, so, so the message I wanted to convey uh, reaches the audience with clarity. Congratulations dears on your success and thanks a lot for talking to Charlian News and back to studio. Country's 77th Independence Day was celebrated at St. Charles with great fervor and joy. School manager Mr. Mary Vargas hoisted the national flag at 8.45 am. It was followed by various cultural events presented by the patriotic Charlians. Honor celebrations titled Honor Vale were held at St. Charles on 25th August. 
The event was marked with spectacular performances that highlighted Kerala's traditional forms of art. That's all from Charlie News today. We will be back with more news and updates. Until then, it's goodbye from Eva Susan Robbins.